So this next uh, tip for Photoshop is really useful. Um, like if you were, let's say you were uh, doing something for your Facebook or Twitter, uh, and you wanted either like a profile picture or uh, to, to make a banner. Um, and it can also be useful if you're designing something like a, like a, a big uh, a poster or something like that. You need it to be a certain size. Uh, it's called the crop tool. Basically, what you do is you go to over here to, to your toolbar and go to crop tool. And then you're going to input how big you need it to be. Uh, over here so if if for instance um, let's say I went to Twitter and they said your profile picture has to be a square and it has to be 400 pixels by 400 pixels so then you just type in 400 px by 400 px and then since it's you know for the internet uh, you're going to want a res resolution at 72. Um, and then all you got to do is just drag it out and uh, get whatever part of the image you want in here. So, let's say I want it to look like that. Then that will give you your uh, 400 by 400 box there. And you can use your arrow tools to kind of guide it to where you want it to be. You can still make it... Uh, bigger or smaller here too um, and then once you got it where you want it to be and right here you can see kind of the rule of thirds so I kind of want to move it right about there and uh, once you get it set all you have to do is just click over here on your toolbar again and it'll say crop the image and you do crop and there you, there you go it's 400 by 400 nice little square for you uh, and you can also do, it doesn't have to be just by pixels, uh, which is really cool, because you can do, let's say you wanted to do a, uh, a poster that had to be, uh, 120 inches wide and, uh, 240 inches tall, and you wanted the resolution to be 300. Well then all you gotta do, same idea, just drag it down like that. Get it lined up where you want it. And click over in your toolbar. Crop all of a sudden. Now this is gonna be huge, but this gives you an idea of just how powerful this tool is. <laughs> this is gonna be huge. Uh, so on a slower computer, yeah, you may uh, pack a lunch if you have to do this. But it gives you just kind of an idea of what all you can do with just a simple computer uh, to, to basically create whatever you want uh, for real-world real applications or, or what have you. I'm going to go ahead and cancel this because this is going to take a really long time on my slow computer, but you get the idea of just what you can do uh, with Photoshop. So there's a little tutorial for you. I hope that helps somebody out. Thanks again.